Do you ever worry that you have to be perfect to be in a video, to be out there, to be visible spreading your message? Because you don't. You do not need to be perfect, I promise. Here's the thing. <laughs> so many people are worried about visibility and seeming like they have to be perfect to show up on screen or to be consistent or that they have to have everything nailed down and be some perfect figure to hold themselves up to in the world that they are now able to help others. And I'm gonna talk to you today an easy peasy visibility tip number three about how all of that is not necessary and what to do instead. Let's talk about it. Hey guys, my name is Misty Petrella. I am a transformational business coach, which means I help you transform the way you look at your business so that you create something that you absolutely love that gets you to regular income. This is for coaches, healers, consultants, wellness experts, anyone with a super lovey-dovey heart. They're really good at their thing, but they're just not great at the marketing and sales stuff. And I gotta tell you, there's lots of ways to make it really simple and easy and loving and connected. So let's talk about visi easy peasy visibility tip number three, which is to stop worrying about being perfect and instead just worry about being you 100%. Really, there is this weird misconception that we have to be perfect in order to help people, to have people follow us, to be seen as an expert, to really do the work you know you're called to do, right? But my life isn't perfect yet, or I haven't nailed this myself yet, or no one's gonna listen to me because I'm not an expert, right? Okay, hello, we all here, I get it, we've all heard those excuses, and I'm here to put a, the kibosh on all of that, okay? Because we think we need to be perfect, but look at the people that you follow. Are any of them perfect? Like, think about the person that you love most in the world. Let's even say, for just famous person's sake, that it's Oprah. It probably isn't, because there's so many people to follow in the world. <laughs> I'm just picking a famous person. But let's say that's who you're, like, emulating and, and holding up to, like, this amazing... She does not proclaim to be perfect. She talks about her struggles all the time. That's what makes her human, relatable, and it actually gives the people that are potentially following you the ability to see that nothing has to be perfect for them to still change their lives. So when you are so worried about being perfect, you're actually discounting a huge thing that your potential clients need, which is to know that this does not need to be perfect. I'm balancing on one foot right now, you just can't see. <laughs> so guys, for real, you don't need to be perfect. You just need to be you. A couple of ways that you can bring your 100% you-ness into your visibility are keep track of the words you say. Like, I make up words all the time. Like, um, I say, I say, like, giganormous. Or I say, I call people smooch or love. You know, like, I bring those words I use in my everyday life. I bring those into my work. Okay, that brings more of me into my work. Another way to create visibility that's more you is to create the visibility that you actually like to receive. So if you don't like reading long blog posts where people go on and on, then don't write those. <laughs> write what you like to receive. That actually really brings a lot of you into your work also in terms of visibility. Um, Another way is to like, you know, I'm in the middle of reconstructing my office right now. So you have a white, <laughs> you have a white corner behind you because what is over here is still in construction. I've had a lot to do this week with clients and stuff, so I haven't been able to work in my office. So that's why you're seeing my office like this. But what I, oh, sorry. What I really, re there we go. Got to get the foot. Okay. <laughs> what I really recommend is that you make your, whatever your, if it's a blog, make that website 100% you. If it's uh, the background of a video you're doing, make that 100% you. If it's, you know, bring you into your work more and more and more and more. 
as much as you possibly can because that's just more fun. And guys, that's those are the things. Our little weird things, our idiosyncrasy, our idiosyncrasies, our things that make us different. Those are the things that people actually follow us for, okay? Because they help people like us and feel like they know us and really start to trust us. And we'll be talking about trust in the next two videos, so don't you worry. But um, <laughs> being you 100% is actually really what people want and need from you. So don't worry about being perfect. Actually, that whole idea is just getting in your way because perfect is just... Well, that's just a perspective also, right? Someone else's version of perfect is very different than yours. So how can we possibly hold ourselves to perfect? It's just not possible. I'm also balancing on one hand again. And you can hear dogs barking in the background. See, not perfect and totally okay. So that is easy peasy visibility tip number three is don't worry about perfect. Worry about bringing you more and more and more into what you're doing, okay? How can you bring more of yourself into it? What else can you do that's more you than nobody else likes? Well, I mean, other people could like it, but it's just the things that you 100% enjoy. This is your business. Don't strip all the cool parts out. That's one of the reasons we work for ourselves, is to bring those, those parts of ourselves that we love into our work. So please do that. It's so much more fun to watch when you're 100% you. I guarantee it, okay? And guys, just so you know, I also want to invite you to my Show Up and Shine Visibility Challenge that starts on Monday the 10th, which is this coming Monday. It is five days of easy peasy, clear and simple visibility, prompts and tools and tips for you to get out there in the world and make it easy to do so while also sharing really important parts of your message that help people know if they want to buy from you or not. So join in. I'm going to drop the link in the box below, so check it out. Super duper important. Also, please, if you found this video helpful for you at all, please like, give me a thumbs up in that thumbs up box below. Also, um, ding that bell and hit subscribe so you'll get the rest of these videos when they come out. Also, I drop videos on Mondays and Thursdays every week anyway, full of tons of amazing content just to help you run a business that you freaking love. All right, guys, I hope you have an amazing day. Thank you so much for joining me for visibility tip number three. I will see you tomorrow on the flip side. Take care.